Abandoned buildings are mysterious places. Who knows what you'll find lurking around the corner or in the basement. Part of the curiosity surrounding abandoned places is the reason they were left in the first place. Although sometimes people who explore forgotten places end up finding something they wish they didn't. In today's video, we're talking about the 10 creepiest things discovered in abandoned buildings. Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to The Supreme, and click the notification bell for more lit content. Let's get rolling. Number 10. A Shark Of all the things you don't want to come across when exploring an abandoned building, a shark is one of them. A shark in a formaldehyde tank was found at Wildlife Wonderland in Victoria, Australia, which had been left abandoned since 2012. Urban explorer Luke McPherson visited the shuttered zoo and uploaded a 28-minute video of his adventure to YouTube in February 2019. The video attracted 14 million views, and the story of the great white shark went viral. It seems that the zoo had been closed due to offenses against wildlife, and the owner didn't have the correct legal licenses to run the attraction. The great white shark, later nicknamed Rosie, was a dead shark shirt in 1998 and put on display in the zoo. The abandoned zoo was unsafe, but largely because the dangerous formaldehyde liquid was leaking from the shark tank. Can you imagine how scared McPherson must have been when he stumbled across Rosie? It isn't often a human comes face to face with a predator of the ocean. I know she wasn't alive, but that kind of made it even creepier. Number 9. Tombstones. In October 2019, a 1930 era building was demolished in the Ukrainian village of Choritsa. As the building was torn down, contractors realized it had been built on hundreds of gravestones. The Soviets had seemingly tried to destroy all signs of the village's previous inhabitants and constructed a building on their graves. The discovery was made nearly 100 years later, and the tombs were traced back to a Mennonite community with ancestors in Manitoba, Canada. It seems Mennonite gravestones are elaborate, which helped in their identification. I wonder if anyone living in the building experienced anything paranormal. Constructing a building on top of a graveyard seems like a terrible idea. Number 8. A Witch did a police officer stumble across the legendary Delray Witch? An officer who identified himself as Ted Robertson was responding to a domestic disturbance call in the Delray area of Detroit in the United States. He said that as the situation had been resolved, he was heading back to the station, but he heard strange sounds coming from a nearby abandoned home. A lot of homes are abandoned in Detroit, so Officer Robertson didn't find it too weird until he got closer to the source of the noise and couldn't decipher what was making it. He then captured this footage from one of the windows. It looks a lot like a ghost, right? In the yard of the property, he found an article about the Delray Witch, a woman called Rose Varez, who was sent to prison for a number of murders. Could Officer Robertson have seen the Delray Witch in that window? Number 7. A Tiger This is a wild story. In February of 2019, a man who was high on cannabis called police to report that he had seen a tiger in an abandoned house in Houston. At first, the police thought that he was hallucinating, but when they arrived to investigate the scene, they did indeed find an overweight tiger locked inside a cramped cage in the garage of an abandoned property. Packages of meat were found nearby in the room, but there were no other signs of a person living there. The tiger was rescued and taken to a local animal sanctuary. Number 6. Old Specimens in the aftermath of the devastating Hurricane Katrina, a lot of buildings were abandoned because they were damaged by flood water. Over 10 years after the disaster, a lot of moldy buildings are waiting for demolition. One building is the Charity Hospital in New Orleans. Before the disaster, it had been used as one of the oldest hospitals in the state of Louisiana. Now it sits in spooky disrepair. Urban explorers photographed the inside of the hospital, even though doing so was a risk to their own health. 
there is plenty of abandoned biohazardous material still around, such as blood specimens and body parts. I think of all the abandoned places I wouldn't want to go and a hospital would be right up there. They're just so spooky anyway. Then add in old vials of blood and urine. That's just too creepy. What would you be most scared of? An old bag of needles or the ghost of a former patient? Number 5. Bomb There are a crazy number of unexploded bombs left after World War II. Despite coming to an end nearly 75 years ago, the biggest war the world has ever seen is still causing chaos. In November of 2019, a World War II hand grenade was found by a worker inside a house in the populated district in Athens, Greece. There isn't an expiration date for explosives. They can be just as dangerous, if not more dangerous today, as they were decades ago. While Greece still had forgotten bombs lingering, Germany is the most affected by unexploded old bombs. During the war, the Allied forces dropped 2.7 million tons of explosives all over Germany. But not all of them went off. Evacuations in cities are a regular occurrence in the European country as old bombs are constantly being rediscovered. Number 4. Padlocked Dungeon Just before Christmas, a newly built padlocked dungeon was found near an unassuming tree in Pickering, Ontario. The 136-year-old farmhouse was long abandoned and hidden out of view. It seems that when contractors arrived to inspect the property for demolition, a new padlocked dungeon was found, causing much alarm. The police kept their findings very hushed and a full-scale investigation began. The story gets even creepier. After the news broke of the discovery, and as police were still combing the property, it mysteriously burned down. This effectively destroyed the majority of evidence in the farmhouse, with police suspecting that this was the motivation behind the blaze. Sometimes, what you don't know makes creepy situations even scarier. What was hiding in that dungeon that was better destroyed than found? Number 3. The Koi Pond This is creepy also, but it's also kind of cool at the same time. An old abandoned shopping mall in Bangkok, Thailand has turned into one giant fish tank after being left to rot. It seems that the New World Mall was never properly approved for opening, so was left to fall into disrepair. The ceiling caved in and rainwater pooled several feet deep. It's thought that the fish were introduced to the water by locals, although some say they were from the original mall's water features. However they got there, they began breeding and now the whole place is one giant fish pond. It looks pretty apocalyptic. Number 2. The Village of Dolls The entire village of Nagoro in Japan is almost totally abandoned. The mountain settlement used to have a population of around 300 people, but since 2016, there have been just 30 residents still living there. While you may think this would mean that buildings are almost totally unoccupied, you'd be wrong. Abandoned buildings are now filled with life-size dolls. Um, hell no. Is anyone else freaked out by dolls? The dolls are the work of villager Tsukimi Ayano, who grew up in the village. Her family left, but she eventually returned and made dolls in their likeness. Since the year 2000, she has made more than 400 dolls to replace the old inhabitants of the village. The fact that they are replacements makes it even creepier. In an empty school sits child dolls wearing the actual clothes of the last living pupils to have studied there. Other dolls can be seen performing tasks across the village. For example, a fisherman doll sits with a rod in a lake. So creepy. Number 1. Fairies Scientific arrangements of the bodies of fairies, werewolves, and aliens were allegedly found in the basement of an old London home. The story goes that in the 1960s, an old abandoned property was being cleared for renovation when a bounty load of curious and super weird specimens were found in the basement. The property was said to belong to 19th century aristocrat collector and biologist Thomas Theodore. A blog post detailing the discovery claims that contractors found several thousand small, tightly sealed boxes. When they opened them, 
they were shocked to find what looked like evidence of mythical creatures. A lot of people consider the collection to be fake, saying that if it were real, then museums would have snapped them up. I'm not so sure. The images look real, but maybe the bodies are actually models. Maybe Thomas Theodore liked making creepy art. What do you think? That was the 10 creepiest things discovered in abandoned buildings. What do you think was the creepiest? Let us know in the comments. Have you ever found anything creepy and abandoned in your neck of the woods? Share your story with us down below.